welcome to my channel. My name is Lee with Lee Photography Studios. In today's video, you're going to be going along with me um, to an outdoor photo shoot. You're going to be seeing a little bit behind the scenes of that photo session here at the lake. Um, I mean, that's where the photo shoot is, is at the lake today. Um, so along with the video, I'm going to be posting some pictures of before and after editing so you can see the differences between how I edit and the raw image. Um, I am taking with me the Canon 7D, that's what I'm recording on right now and that's what the, the video vlog is going to be recorded on. And then I'm taking my Canon 5D Mark IV um, camera for the actual photos itself. So that those are the two pieces of equipment that I'm bringing. I'm possibly bringing a, a light just in case I'm going to be needing that. Um, I may not bring that out though because I do want to have a more natural lighting situation. Um, but just in case I need some filler light, um, if I do end up using that, I'll link that down below on what I use um, for that. So I hope you enjoy this video. If you do enjoy this video, go ahead and give it a like. Um, if you want to see more, go ahead and comment down below and subscribe to my channel. If you do subscribe to my channel, go ahead and click on the bell as well. That way you're notified of any future videos that I may post. I hope you enjoy. My client and I were talking at this point, but I wanted to show how far we had to walk to get to the point where we were headed. It's beautiful. So here we are at the location and I'm about to set up gorgeous. Okay, so I'm having to do voiceover um, for this video because as you can see, the wind was so intense that day and so you couldn't hardly understand what I was talking about and I was far away from the mic. But here, I'm explaining to the client what I'm wanting her to do with this fabric once she gets posed and in her outfit. So I'm just kind of giving her a quick tutorial or an example of what I want her to do with the material. My first several shots are just testing lighting and seeing what settings to put my camera at. As you can see, I'm also battling the sun. The sun was directly behind us, and so it was difficult in the beginning to get my settings the way I wanted it. Quick correction, the sun was behind the model, in front of me. In the meantime, you can see the client just messing around with the fabric, getting comfortable with the fabric. She's not in her outfit yet, um, but she um, wanted to test it out to see how it was flowing. She also wanted to keep warm as long as possible, because in a minute you're going to see what she ended up wearing. So. That's why she stayed in her sweat for as long as possible. Okay, so the client here is going to go ahead and get ready for the shoot and get undressed. So just go ahead and start moving, but give like very subtle movements. Okay. Some look away, some look down, keep and then look at me, but always stay pretty serious. without this because this is only firing off every so often. I feel the need to apologize here. The wind was blowing so hard. We are in the middle of December and it was pretty cold out so my nose was burning and I couldn't, there was nothing I can do about it. That same thing but come to me a little bit more with your body and everything. Yeah, 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 yeah. 
Yeah, that's pretty. Stay just like that. Smile a tiny bit. Can you pull your hair? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Did it get in front of you? Is it still right here? I can't see. It looks like it is a little bit. Okay, I think I got it. I don't okay. <laughs> yeah, that's The other one down. This one or this one? Left. The left. And then turn, yeah, yeah, yeah. Stay right there. Yeah, that expression on your face is perfect. Now look down, the same pose, yeah. So pretty, hold it. So go ahead and do your little dance moves again, okay. but just still remember to point your toe and be in an S shape. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. Well, we should have started right here. Do that thing that you did earlier where you were kind of treating the fabric as a wall and so you were like leaning against your fabric wall. Be more curvy with it. Yeah. Ooh, that's pretty. Do that same thing. Ooh, did you almost fall? No. Oh, okay. And then look out that way. Yeah, bring the fabric down a little bit. Yeah. Bring it back around, but down. Yeah. And then bring your left foot forward more so you're more bendy. Bring the fabric up, yeah, that way it's shading your butt out a little bit so it's away, yeah. Trying to like find a place to put my foot. Yeah. Maybe go ahead and sit. Do you see that, like, it looks like a step up right there? Right. Put your bare bottom on that, and then let the material fall. 
and then be like elongate out your legs. Yeah, that's pretty. Look down like you did. And then look at me. The only thing is, is I can't see a difference between the fabric and your bodysuit. So maybe bring the fabric up for, a sh for one, like all the way up like this, you know? But can you do this and then have the fabric up more? Or does it come too much like, yeah, that's pretty. Look straight at me. Smile just a, li a little bit. You look like a bat. Oh, that's pretty. <laughs> <laughs> you do, you look like a bat. Okay, so on our way back to our vehicles, I wanted to stop down here and get into the water because I really thought that, well, A, it was nicely shaded, and B, I really loved the orange reflection of the trees in the lake at this point. And so we went ahead and we shot a few down here. I'm really sad that the video ended up cutting off halfway through our shoot down in this location. So you won't see video clips of it, but I'm gonna post pictures after this clip to show you those photos because we got about thigh deep in the water and those I think are my favorite pictures from this session. They're beautiful. Again, I want to thank you for watching the video. Please do subscribe, and I look forward to seeing you in my next video. See you later.